Hi, this is Matt from topbarbiesmn.blogspot.com. As you can see, there's a bumblebee right there, and just flew out of the picture, there's a honeybee right there. So I've been quite lazy this summer. My blog has not been updated like it should be. I bought materials to make a mason bee house and a bumblebee house. Never made them. I built three new bait hives. Never put them out. And as you can see, my lawn is in need of mowing and being overrun with clover. What my laziness has gotten me though is, oh and I never put a, I was gonna plant a bee garden, which I never did. What my laziness has gotten me though is this yard full of clover that the bumblebees and honeybees and um, some native bees too, I don't see any out right now. I'll, well, the bumblebee's native, but um, other other native bees. If I see one, I'll uh, grab a picture of those too, but it's kind of nice. I can't keep bees in the city, but my overgrown lawn is definitely attracting some. There's one bumblebee, so the honeybee, here's another bumblebee. Every time I come outside, there's just bees buzzing all over, which is exciting. Now that I have the materials for the bumblebee house and mason bee house and have some extra bait hives built, maybe next spring I'll actually um, not be lazy and get off my butt and put them out. But in the meantime, like I said, my laziness makes it so I can enjoy seeing some bees in my yard from time to time, even though I can't keep them in the city. Anyway, that's that. Just thought I'd show you. Um, I'll try to do an update on my hives soon. Talk to you later. Bye. Hi, it's Matt again. There's a little native bee right there. I don't know if it'll focus on that. Just moving some stuff in my garage. This little guy is sitting on this bookshelf that I'm trying to sell. It doesn't really focus though. I point away and point back if it'll focus. Not really, huh? Oh, there's a native bee.